Yo, what's going on, guys? Cali Cowboy. Uh, how's it going? How's the draft going? How's your weekend going? Uh, <laughs> this weekend has been pretty good for me. It's been one of the best weekends of in a while. You know, we had NFL draft. I watched Avengers. <laughs> I saw Pacquiao, uh, Mayweather Pacquiao, even though I was going for Pacquiao, even <laughs> And Mayweather took it, but uh, hey, it was a good good fight, not the most entertaining, but uh, you know, uh, I don't want to get into it, too much into it because I'm not a boxing expert, but I felt like Mayweather, I don't like his style. But anyways, you know, it was a great weekend, hope your weekend was great too. Um, this this draft, just want to touch on it real quick, uh, I'm overall, I'm liking, I'm liking the draft, you know, it's not too spectacular, these past few drafts we've been... Uh, very smart in who we picked uh, last year, picking not picking Manziel and getting Zach Martin, uh, and that that resulted in a Pro Bowl, <laughs> a Pro Bowl uh, offensive lineman. So you know this strategy is really translating into this year, and it's showing that we are this year we picked basically off not of need but best player available and sticking to our board and sticking to what philosophy we want to do. You know we pick straight, you know base team base team needs they're building this team from the inside out not not from the outside in they, they didn't draft any skill players just not a quarterback running back wide receiver the only offensive players they've drafted were more offensive linemen to build the strength of the offensive line and to uh and then a seventh round tight end and he's a run blocking tight end so you can see that we, we're already we like what we got on offense already you know i like what we got on offense already you know we got cole beasley des Bryant, terrence williams uh, and we, we, you know, we got uh, Ryan Williams, we got D Darren McFadden, Joseph Randall, Lance Dunbar. We're probably going to go with more of a committee. Maybe we'll give uh, Darren McFadden the first, you know, the first go around, the, the majority of the carries. But we're probably going to give Joseph Randall the, uh, the uh, some snaps as well. So, you know, I'm excited to see what we got. You know, that's pretty cool where we're going to give Joseph Randall a chance, Darren McFadden a chance. If they can stay healthy, if they can stay consistent behind this offensive line we got going, then I think we can really do something with it. And defensively, th this was definitely a defensive uh, defensive uh, focused draft. You know, you can tell by the first pick, they really wanted to uh, address the cornerback, the secondary, so they went with Byron Jones. Uh, that's the only kind of skill position, quote, that we uh, actually got. Because cornerback is kind of the dynamic position, and we've been hit or miss on it, you know, fast past few uh, past few years. Only cornerback, our best cornerback is Scandrick, and he's uh, you know, he's having trouble uh, right now in the off season. He's a little disgruntled. So you know, we got Mo and we got Carr, and now we got Byron Jones, who can play safety and corner. So I think that's really really good for us. Uh, then we went with the surprise pick of the whole draft uh, for the Cowboys. Uh, we got Randy Gregory, which is a beast, but you know, we have to deal with him like we did with Dez. Got to develop him into you know the right kind of guy that we want and he's surrounded by you know Jason Witten, Romo, uh, Sean Lee he's got the right kind of guys in the locker room and we also got to uh, you know work with Greg Hardy as well so you know we got some work to do in the uh, the personnel department but I believe we got the right uh, right foundation the right staff to to handle that so um, other than that we got some linebackers we got some uh, some more defensive ends I like that I love stockpiling on the defense for right now you know because we need it our defense was a liability for the past few years, we've been uh, pretty much just overachieving and, uh, you know, pretty much, uh, you know, playing on guts and emotion on defense last year. And that was good. But wouldn't it be better if we played on talent and guts and emotion? So, you know, I love the, I love the idea that we're going to we're stockpiling our linebackers and our D line. And we got a really good player, cornerback that we can work on. So love the draft overall. Let me know what y'all think of it. Well, what you think of it? We didn't draft a running back. You know, that was a pretty pretty big need, but I guess they believe in it. But what do you think? Uh, I was hoping we got David Johnson in third. Couldn't get him. None of them fell to us. So, hey, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, this is actually going to be a video. You know, one of my last videos in a while because I am actually going on. Uh, I'm working on with this new company. It's really changing my life. It's really you know helping me out. Being able to do what I want to do, which is this full time, but it's really changing my life. It's this game. It's not a, you know, it's not an Xbox game. It's it's a reality, immersive reality game where it's in, it's it's crazy, y'all. If you want to check out what it is, you know, I have a link in the description below. Just check that out, and uh, yeah. So probably will be my last video until maybe mini camps and all that uh, around maybe July or something. Maybe I'll make a few, you know, uh, 
few videos in between, but you never know because I am going to be busy. So thanks, guys, for watching. Cali Cowboy is out, and you guys have a great week.